What is up everybody? This is Big Ox Triple Six here and check it out. I was gonna make the video of Final Fantasy Twelve, the Zodiac Age Monday, but I was like, you know what? I don't feel like doing it right now. I'm gonna wait a few days and um they announced this game gonna be remastered. This PlayStation oh my god. Final Fantasy Twelve was was pretty much on the PlayStation Two and they're pretty much doing updated graphics. Um a newly like re redesigned a uh, recorded soundtrack also a new reconstructed battle battle design revamped job system and pretty much updated graphics which looks looks pretty cool but in a trailer I wasn't impressed I really wasn't it was just like basically meh to me and <laughs> it kind of it, it, it how can I put it I have the Final Fantasy 12 collector's collector edition right here unopened and stuff unopened and um I do have the original copy but I put maybe 30 hours into Final Fantasy 12 for the PlayStation 2 I tried, I tried, I really, I really did, but it was just the gameplay, the gameplay, the w the way they had the battle system. It, oh, I don't know. It it was like Final Fantasy Eleven Online, which I have it in my treasure box. I I think I have two two of the copies for the PlayStation Two of. The expansion one, the original game and an expansion pack, and it played just like that, and I hated it. I hated it so much, and I really tried. And they, if they actually have like the same gameplay from um, Final Fantasy One and Ten, I'll be okay with it. I really would, or you know, like Final Fantasy um, Type Zero HD, that type of you know action, which that's not gonna freaking be possible and stuff like that but uh, if it doesn't change their gameplay like actual change the gameplay like actual turn based which it was turn based but it was just it was just weird the way they the way they had it it was just like you you just wait or walk around around the enemy then attack they walk around the enemy then attack again it it, it was it was a weird concept how, how they how they did the gameplay of it I mean the story I couldn't get into it I really couldn't get into it and also if are they gonna do like the I know there's Final Fantasy 12 then they had Final Fantasy 12 like for the for the DS I don't know if it's average 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 wings something like that I'm not I'm not quite sure sorry I had to look it up it was Revenant wings for the Nintendo uh, DS um, I don't know if that's gonna have a you know add that in the game as well or what they're just pretty much going to do Final Fantasy 12 for the PlayStation 2 and that's it but um, how I got this one right here this is like my very first collector edition you know game and um, I pretty much want try to buy this on GameStop um, years, years, years ago, and they were sold out. And I was just like, "Well, well, crap! Where can I get the collector edition from?" And I was pretty much young and dumb, so I pretty much went to my my Walmart back in back in Texas and stuff like that, and pretty much asked, you know, one of the one of the sales associate, um, asked them, "Dude." Do y'all have? Do, are you guys gonna have um, Final Fantasy Twelve the collector edition? And this associate I was talking to, you know, in, in the very front at Walmart and stuff like that. He was all like, "Yeah, yeah, dude, we we always get the collector edition and stuff like that." Man, you want to pre-order stuff or like, something? I'm like, if you can get the collector edition, cool. I'll I'll pre-order. I put I put you know my money down stuff like that, which I did. And you know, I waited up maybe like a month or two for the stuff come out because I like to get early. If I want to buy something, I like to get the get the stuff. You know, pay everything off right then and there. I don't wait. Be like, 
$20 here, $30 there. No, I'll pay everything right then, right now. But that's how I am. But anyways, a month or a month and a half passed. And um, went up there to get my game and stuff. And it same guy gave me gave me the game. I'm like, look at the look the, look at the game. It was a regular the regular game, and I was like looking at him, looked at the game. I was like, dude, this is not the collector edition. I wanted the collector edition, and the guy told me, he's like, oh, we never get the collector edition, man. Um, do you want your money back? I'm, and I was like pissed. I was like literally like pissed because I, I in my head I was not gonna get this collector edition. Because, you know, it was Final Fantasy. I really wanted the collector edition. And I was like, dude, I want my money now. I don't care how you get it. I want my money now. And he's like, dude, just calm down. Calm down. I was like, dude, I've been waiting for this game to come out. I wanted this freaking collector edition. And you tell me you don't freaking have it? Give me my money now. So he pretty much did. And I was, like, pissed. Pissed off because I didn't know how I was going to get this collector edition or what. So I, was, I tried GameStop one more time. The same day when it freaking came out, and I was surprised because usually GameStop don't have any, you know, any collector editions because they usually sold out quick. And I checked online. Su surprisingly, they had one for sale. So I bought that thing real quick, and I waited about a week, and that's how I got this from right here. I do have the original copy, but I played it for about 25 to 30 hours, dude. I tried so hard and it, it was just it was just a gameplay and the story was just like slow like slow like Final Fantasy 5 slow Final Fantasy 3 slow that type of slowness and I'm just like oh my god I, I, I can't I can't do this I can't do it man but if if they actually change the battle system okay I, I will try it again you know but I started playing, you know, this one right here for a little bit, Final Fantasy um, Type Zero HD. It is actually, actually pretty, pretty decent game. I think this was like um, the PSP game for Japan first, till we finally got it maybe like a year ago, and try it out. And it's like, yeah, this is an awesome Final Fantasy game. Action pack and the intro. Oh my gosh, man! It. Was, I think this is the first Final Fantasy game was actually like like violent and bloody and I was like like there was a lot of blood like a lot of freaking like killing I was just like wow that is like a new one to me <laughs> you know because you don't actually see people like dying except Final Fantasy like 10 but this was like more bloodier than that and I was just like wow okay but um yeah I'm enjoying this one but I want to let you guys know I'm I, I don't know I'm I don't know if I'm gonna actually buy it or not I, I have to rent it First, if I like it, I'll probably buy it. If they change the gameplay, other than that, I'm I'm gonna skip. I would like playing Final Fantasy 15, but I have a bunch of Final Fantasy games I need to finish, like 13 and so on. Which lightning's hot. <laughs> just saying. But um, that's about it, guys. I just want to let you guys know my, about my my two cents about Final Fantasy 12. The Zodiac Age and stuff like that. But anyways, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Um, that's about it. I'm going to go back and play some more Fable 3. And try to get my Xbox One. You know, and do an unboxing for you guys. But anyways, this is Big Ox Triple Six. Y'all stay awesome. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.